Quick quiz on matter. Dash consists of single type of particles. Pure substance consists of single type of particles. Dash contains more than one substance mixed in any proportion. A mixture contains more than one substance mixed in any proportion. Dash mixtures have uniformity in color and texture. Homogeneous mixtures have uniformity in color and texture. Dash mixture has physically distinct parts and has non-uniform compositions. Heterogeneous mixtures has physically distinct parts and has non-uniform composition. Dash is a homogeneous mixture of two or more substances. Solution is a homogeneous mixture of two or more substances. The major component of the solution that dissolves the other component in it is called the dash. The major component of the solution that dissolves the other component in it is called the solvent. The minor component of the solution that is dissolved in the solvent is called the dash. The minor component of the solution that is dissolved in the solvent is called the solute. Dash is a heterogeneous mixture in which the solute particles do not dissolve but remain suspended throughout the bulk of the medium. Suspension is a heterogeneous mixture in which the solute particles do not dissolve but remain suspended throughout the bulk of the medium. Dash is a heterogeneous mixture in which the particles are uniformly spread throughout the solution and scatter light. Colloidal solution is a heterogeneous mixture in which the particles are uniformly spread throughout the solution and scatter light. The solute-like component or the dispersed particles is called the dash of the colloidal solution. The solute-like component or the dispersed particles is called the dispersed phase of the colloidal solution. The component of the colloidal solution in which the dispersed phase is suspended is known as the dash. The component of the colloidal solution in which the dispersed phase is suspended is known as the dispersion medium. The scattering of a beam of light is called the dash. The scattering of a beam of light is called the Tyndall effect. When no more solute can be dissolved in the solution at a given temperature, it is called a dash. When no more solute can be dissolved in the solution at a given temperature, it is called a saturated solution. If the amount of solute contained in the solution is less than the saturation level, it is called a dash. If the amount of solute contained in the solution is less than the saturation level, it is called an unsaturated solution. The amount of solute present in the saturated solution 
at a given temperature is called a dash. The amount of solute present in the saturated solution at a given temperature is called solubility. Dash is defined as the amount of solute present per unit volume or per unit mass of the solution. Concentration of a solution is defined as the amount of solute present per unit volume or per unit mass of the solution. Dash is a change that occurs without a change in composition and no change in the chemical nature of the substance. Physical change is a change that occurs without a change in composition and no change in the chemical nature of the substance. Dash is a change where one substance reacts with another to undergo a change in chemical composition. Chemical change is a change where one substance reacts with another to undergo a change in chemical composition. Dash is a process of separating heterogeneous mixtures into their respective constituents using filter paper. Filtration is a process of separating heterogeneous mixtures into their respective constituents using filter paper. Dash is a process of separating the volatile component from its non-volatile component. Evaporation is a process of separating the volatile component from the non-volatile component. Dash method can be used to separate colloidal particles from a colloidal solution. Centrifugation method can be used to separate colloidal particles from a colloidal solution. Dash method can be used to separate mixtures containing a sublimable volatile component from a non-sublimable impurity. Sublimation method can be used to separate mixtures containing a sublimable volatile component from a non-sublimable impurity. Dash is a technique used for separation of solutes that dissolve in the same solvent and the constituents of the mixture travel at different speeds. Chromatography is the technique used for separation of solutes that dissolve in the same solvent and the constituents of the mixture travel at different speeds. Dash is a method for the separation of components of a mixture containing two miscible liquids that boil without decomposition and have sufficient difference in their boiling points. Distillation is a method for the separation of components of a mixture containing two miscible liquids that boil without decomposition and have sufficient difference in their boiling points. Dash process is used for separation of a mixture of two or more miscible liquids having difference in boiling points less than 25 Kelvin. Fractional distillation process is used for separation of a mixture of two or more miscible liquids having difference in boiling points less than 25 Kelvin. Dash is a process that separates a pure solid in the form of its crystals from a solution. Crystallization is a process that separates a pure solid in the form of its crystals from a solution.
dash illustrious good conductors of heat and electricity ductile malleable and sonorous metals illustrious good conductors of heat and electricity ductile malleable and sonorous dash have variety of colors are poor conductors of heat and electricity non metals have variety of colors and they are poor conductors of heat and electricity dash are those elements which exhibit intermediate properties between those of metals and non metals metalloids are those elements which exhibit intermediate properties between those of metals and non metals a dash is a substance composed of two or more elements chemically combined with one another in a fixed proportion a compound is a substance composed of two or more elements chemically combined with one another in a fixed proportion